Namaskar, welcome back to another video of Indian Student in Canada series. And in this video, I'm going to talk about how I got my first full time professional job in Canada and you know how long it took and how much it was the salary and all those details. So stay tuned. So I actually got graduated in 2013 December. So this is way long ago, but what I did really applies even till the day. So as soon as I graduated, I, I applied for my work permit. And before this, we had a co-op like, you know, in my course, uh, I had to get a co-op for four months and work in a professional company as an intern for free or for salary. So that time I literally applied for more than three to 400 companies and never got a call. I didn't understand what the heck is happening. So fast forward after my graduation, I, I saw so many people working, you know, full-time jobs, but non-professional jobs. Salary was like only $10, $12 per hour, which, which will, which is like, you know, per month, you will be getting paid like $2,000, $2,500 um, in total. And if you work more hours, you will get maybe $3,000, $3,500. So basically, if you're getting a full-time 40 hours hours, uh, your pay is like $2,500, right? So from that $2,500, literally, you have like $1,000 car payment, uh, installment and, you know, insurance and gas and then your uh, room rent and your groceries and your parties and paying the debt. So it's not enough at all. So that's why like literally me and my friends, we decided, you know what, let's take shut down here. Let's stop working part-time jobs and only focus on full-time job. So that's why like we literally stopped doing that. Um, and only was working like on Sunday or one day or one and a half day, something like that, just to pay for our, you know, room, room rents. And we didn't even have a car. We didn't even, you know, put any expenses. So that's why just one day, two days paying for our expenses. And then we actually joined a consultancy, a job consultancy, because before the horrible experience couldn't find the job quickly. And Personally, like I didn't had any job experience back home and neither here professional job experience. So that was really struggle to get a job. So that's why like we were looking for, you know, good job consultancies who can train us and help us to find the job. So we find one consultancy who were offering IT programming, you know, job consultancy. So what they told us like, you will have like everyday morning uh, course where we teach the programming um, specific um, uh, language that you really need to apply in your jobs. And then during the evening, you have to practice all the programming and also you have to apply for the you know jobs and they will be helping us to prepare the resume. They'll be helping us how to attend the interviews and all those things. So literally like for six months, all we were doing was working on Saturday and Sunday or one sometimes only on Saturdays. And then rest of the days, morning wake up around like six, seven, eight, um, have the breakfast, have some chai, and then sit on the computer, learning the course and practicing, practicing and applying for jobs. Sometimes take some break with watching a movie or <laughs> some comedy show. So that's what we were doing. Like sometimes, man, why, what the fuck is happening? No, no one is calling us back. Like first two months, no calls came through. Um, but like, you know, our consultant, they were like constantly helping us to um, rectify our resume, uh, helping us to how to talk, how to attend the interviews, um, all those things. Like it, it was like slow process because I didn't had experience. So it took six months to get the first job. Um, actually took two months to get the first call and then like we eventually started to get some calls but i think in canada it's a lot 
a lot more slower comparative to us in terms of like you know the amount of jobs available for it but at the same time what i realized after once you have experience once you have experience canadian experience on resume once you have like you know um solid subject it's a lot easier to crack a job so later in the career i realized you know that's what i would re recommend any new person student or anyone looking to find a job man first get a solid skill set on any industry that you're looking to and at the same time find out how it works in canada the job process interview process what kind of skills the uh, you know canadian employers look for so those things really important i like when i was looking for internship i i couldn't find even i couldn't even get one call because i was trying myself all myself um then i, I took some help from the consultancies all of a sudden like now you know it took it took some time but at least we started to get calls and we started to you know crack the interviews and finally got a job that was in Windsor um so at that time it was a contract job so in Canada um i think it's anywhere in the world like you have a contract job or full time job so if you get a full time job generally your salary is uh, lower in terms of monthly but they give you some additional like you know benefits uh, like health benefits um giving some stocks in the company and additional things and contract job all you get is like hourly salary uh, you get like $50 or $30 or $20 so that time i got $50 per hour oh uh, maybe $47 something per hour um and after that you know consultancy because they help us they take um a cut from it and then they give us so i was making uh, after all taxes and um all the expenses i was making $4250 something around that um that's based on the hours and you know sometimes if 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 i uh, work less then uh, um, i'll get less salary but uh, that was approximately my salary was and then that, because it was in windsor um i i still did not buy my car because i was i want to pay my debts so yeah you know, i was just like literally spending 1500 dollars and i was just paying off all my debt from back home so that's how i got my first job and it was like dot net developer and that's another nightmare once i got the job it's freaking i was working for a software company for the first time like uh, in canada and it was like really really a uh, new environment but thank god the the culture in canadian companies lot more friendly they're really nice like they they wanted to help you to you know learn new things learn uh, improve your skills um they they're more friendly they're not like you know bossy kind of the, at least my company was not like that um uh, and i i knew like lot of uh, canadian um bosses or like more friendly um but at the same time they screen you always they see how is your performance if you perform well you 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 know you will you will be always uh, treated well as well and you will be getting good salary as well especially in IT industry that's a decent salary so that was my first job experience uh let me know your experience if you are in canada got your first how did you get your first job in canada i'm curious to hear let me know in the comments below hope this is helpful for you if it does hit that thumbs up button and the subscribe button and share button and we'll see you in the next video of indian student in canada series until then have a wonderful day